president is behind this, and we need Congress to support it, and I believe that support will be there. Yes, all the way in the back. Uh, thank you. You mentioned how suicide prevention is one of your top priorities. Prevent suicide prevention, yes. yes. In that context, uh, are you willing maybe to sit down with DOD and encourage uh, the active duty officers to go on record about their mental uh, problems and uh, issues while they are still on active duty, so you avoid in a way that it shows up only after they leave the service? We, we, are, we are doing exactly that. We are in discussions with the Department of Defense, Secretary Mattis and I have talked about this. We know that what we're doing is not enough, and we have to look at exactly the issues that start in the Department of Defense and make sure that we're addressing them. The transition time is and, and that gap between when you leave active service to when you enter as a civilian and you get health care, we have to, that's an area that we have to pay particular concern about. That's why this EHR is going to be helpful. But we have to look all the way back into the process, just as you're suggesting. So we are doing that. Yes.